Hi there, it's May Ross here from 321 Acting Studios. I'm the founder, and welcome back to uh, Miss May's Vlog Blog. And today, our topic, manners. We're talking about manners on the set, manners in the theater, when you're rehearsing, manners at auditions, just all the way around. But let's say you're on set, okay? So we're gonna take the sample of being on set. You're on a film set, you're excited because you're thrilled to be, uh, to be booked, and uh, so it's so important to have appropriate manners so that you're thought of, fond of uh, after the shoot and after you wrap. First things first, a uh, smile on your face, right? That seems pretty obvious, yes. Uh, and then, uh, you know, a firm handshake, you know, meeting the people is always a nice thing. When you get to uh, the dining manners, uh, don't overfill your plate when you are in line. Know that the crew eats first and then the stars, and then of course you, because you're a star too, right? And uh, you can always go back for seconds. When you're eating, uh, we don't chew with our mouth open. Why? Because it's offensive. So let's remember that manners and etiquette, the reason why they're in place is um, to make sure that the other person feels good. So manners care about the other person, right? That's why we open doors, that's why we uh, smile and we are interested in the other person. So another thing uh, about dining manners is you wanna make sure that you bring your food up to your mouth, right? Rather than your, rather than the food down, okay, your mouth down. Um, several things that you don't think of that, you know, all the details that make you um, shine and that make you a person that people wanna be around. Uh, definitely use your napkin. Napkin goes in your lap. It's the first time you sit down anywhere. Uh, napkin goes in your lap first, of course. And uh, yeah, don't slurp your beverage. Okay, so don't be slurping your beverage. That's not um, exactly appealing also. So be a civilized eater. Moving on, you wanna follow all instructions and uh, be grateful. So yes, sure, I'll, I'll go to the wardrobe trailer and go get my shoes, even though the wardrobe trailer's down the road a bit. You know, you're all gonna do that. Uh, also, when having conversations with people, make sure that you have a two-sided conversation so that, uh, you know, whether you're talking to a crew, whoever you're talking to, be nice and show that you're interested. Good manners show that you're interested in the other people and the people want to, um, to share about themselves. They really do, even if they don't seem like it. But that's good manners. Staying positive is always the greatest kind of greatest manners you can be, all right? Because people want to be around positive people. It puts people at ease. Everybody can be a little tense on the set. There's a lot of things that are going on. So, uh, you know, stand up straight. Uh, talk to the person next to you. It may be the person that you're going to be doing a scene with. You never know. Take things in stride, okay? Part of manners is taking things in stride. So expecting the unexpected. Maybe your role gets changed or something like that. Open doors for people and just get to those those good manners all right so i hope this is helping you today come back and visit me again i've got more blog blogs down the line uh this is may ross from 321 acting studios we're an acting school in los angeles for kids teens and young adults and we do offer a free class and we have an awesome online course too so just go to 321 acting studios check out our online course. It's great, particularly if you live out of the Los Angeles area and you really wanna get started in the entertainment industry. So good to have you here. I'm here to help and come back and see me next time, okay? Wonderful, bye now.